I live half a block from all this fabulous stuff, and I'd like to learn more about what's right here in my backyard to understand it more and to appreciate it more. We just moved to Vancouver. It's just been so easy to find a home here. Everyone is so welcoming, and we're just walking for lunch, and here we are doing a tie-dye party. Sweet Jackson Cafe. It's a small neighborhood grant from Vancouver Foundation. It's our third year running the cafe in this neighborhood, Strathcona. Yeah, everything's free at the cafe coffee, croissant, the accoutrement for those. And then this year we decided to add a tie dye party element. Yeah, so we've been here for uh, about a month and a half. We just moved to Vancouver. It's just been like so easy to, to find a home here. Everyone is so welcoming and in a unique way as well. Like everyone's doing their own thing here. Uh, there's a way to get involved uh, in so many different ways. Like we're just walking for lunch and here we are doing a tie-dye party. There's always a way to meet people and a way to get involved in some like really cool project. What color is this? I think that's blue. That's blue, green, purple, and black. It's so welcoming and it feels like everyone's not too far apart. I like it. Isn't it nice? Beautiful, yeah. Ah, so elegant. Thank you for pushing it down there. You are a very good stirrer. I'm Lynn and I'm one of the uh, local uh, residents here in southeast Vancouver, in our beautiful little secret spot in the city. We just went for a lovely walk with Will Oberson, one of our neighbors who happens to be at Arbor's. This is trembling aspen. There's one, two, oh, wow. three. They call them trembling because in the wind they, they make that lovely little noise, you know? Oh. It's neat to just down. get so many different kinds of people out, people enough. who don't know each other, and this is a chance for people to say hi and meet a new neighbor. It's like a maple. Oh, the one, behind it. the one in the back. So some of these are probably original forest. Uh, everything in here is native trees. And here we are in the middle of East Vancouver, eh? Who would know? There's so much to know. I live half a block from all this fabulous stuff, and I'd like to learn more about what's right here in my backyard to understand it more and to appreciate it more as I do my little uh, loops around the golf course. So we're so fortunate to just have this little bit of a little bit of belt of what it was like um, you know, it's hung in there somehow, and now it's preserved, so this will always be like this. One of my favorite things that's happen every year is that I get to meet people who then I get to see elsewhere in the neighborhood, and just really, like, building on the community that already is really strong in this community of Strathcona. Just having this, like, positive experience of sharing and of joy and of, like, family fun that then can carry on out into the neighborhood and uh, help us to feel like more engaged and connected and safe and strong here together. Yes! yes. <laughs> so it's I think, important to have small events like this that, that share and that celebrate um, and that's, that's the whole deal, so yeah.